Okay, today we're going to be stuffing a couple of horses from the Horses and Hearts Riding Club. They just added a new horse, which is that gray one up there. The breed is the Appaloosa. So that's some of the outfits you can we'll have a bear. You can have a riding outfit for your bear. This is a American Quarter Horse. That is the breed it's supposed to be, and the color is Palomino. And we have a thoroughbred horse, which is right here. And the color is bay. This is the new one here. It looks like it's a horse breed that belongs to one of the Native Americans. Let's see, Appaloosa. See, in horses, they let you know what the color is first before they mention the horse breed. There's lots of accessories. So I'll show you that before we stuff them. It's like a blanket. And... <laughs> Stable. Some bows, clips. <laughs> so for the sound, do you want it in the one with the heart or the one with the paw? Uh, let's do the heart. The heart? Mm-hmm. There's no other one, right? So it's four different sounds. Yeah, it's four different. <laughs> oh, you're kidding. <laughs> I know this song. All right, go for it. <laughs> Girl. Do you already have a name for her? Uh, yes, I'm gonna name her Wind Rider. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out if I should spell that with an I or a Y. Rider, this is sometimes a girl's name. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think if you want to be different, probably spell it with a Y. I was thinking of that because there, I think there was this one TV character or someone was named, I think it was a TV character, her name was Rider and it spelled with a Y. So I was y. thinking like, uh, you know, to make it more interesting, you know, instead of an actual writer, you make it yeah. spell a little bit. I know Ryder on the show Paw Patrol, he, mm -hmm. he spells his with an I. Yeah. Oh, it's actually supposed to be Dawn Ryder because she's a, a Palomino American Quarter Horse, kind of American. Uh, okay. Yeah, and I wasn't one Ryder. I was trying to decide what kind of horse name I should name her, but I think Dawn because I, I didn't want it to be Sunset. I didn't want to be, I wanted something to do with the sun, something like, I wanted an American sounding. Well, something yeah. like a Native American would name, might name it. Because it's an American breed, so, you know, something just American sounding. Do you like horses? Oh, I love horses. Um, they're my third favorite after, I like dogs, cats, real close to each other, and I like horses three. Um, I'm not, I've never actually ridden a horse. I've ridden a pony, like when I was like young. Um, and I, we petted miniature horses and we petted like, actual horses. Yeah. Um, I was like the, the Mm, it's the nose part that's really soft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but never actually ridden How does that one. Feel? Okay. Feels good. I mean, she'll okay. last a long time. And then. Let's <coughs> give that one. Make some noise there. Okay, is that the first time? Sounds like it's hot. Okay, I guess that's the fourth sound. Yes. <laughs> Alright, and then are we going to add any smells or anything inside this? Uh, no, not this time. Uh, Alright, you want to grab a heart? Yep. Make a big wish and give the heart a big kiss. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Alright, all right, go for it. So are you doing one on the horses now? Uh, yes. I would have been started, but the um, the other bear wasn't stuffed. You don't have all the outfits out, so I was like, the red one and the gold one isn't here, so all of these science outfits over there, so I decided, eh, I'll just get that. <laughs> you don't like the gray one? Oh, the gray's fine, but I like the uh, these two the best. Yeah. That one's different. I mean, I like the fact that they base these on actual horse breeds versus yeah. like you walk out like, well, what is it? Horses, you, they look so close to each other unless you're a real horse expert. You're know, like, yeah. well, what is that? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> What is this one going to be named? Mr. Ed. Mr. <laughs> Ed? Yeah, Mr. Ed, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really? He just told me that just now. He didn't tell me at all. I was over here thinking, oh, what am I going to name my horse? And I looked it up, there's like horse website and everything. And I, and I like, you got to think of a name you're going to name your horse. <laughs> I like it. Well, I like that horse. You know, it's a talking horse. You know, yeah. The yeah. funny thing about that one, he was a, uh, the color was a, he was a Palomino. The color, I don't know what breed he was, but the color, Mr. Ed, he was Palomino. Um, I don't know what breed, but because the first the first word in the title of a horse breed, they tell you the color first before they tell you the breed. So this color here is bay, and then thoroughbred that'd be the breed. So All right, let's uh, see. I checked out a, a book about horses at the library, so because I wanted to know more about horses. <laughs> and then how's this guy? Okay. Well, this time. Why not? Okay. Yeah, why not? <laughs> you got to run in there. So what else, what other like guys have you done on your YouTube channel? Well, let's see, what have I done? I've done, oh, hmm, Snoopy and Woodstock. Really? Yeah, they actually got the most views for a while until the Honey Girls took over. Now they're up to over 19,000. Uh, yeah, and the funny thing is, Snoopy's been around. I think the helped with the Peanuts thing came out. Yeah. And, um, with green. This is what, like, not. Okay. We'll do a double shot here. Here at the dressing room station. All right, so we brought them home, and here they are, safe and sound, in their little barns. Each we got we got separate brushes here. Okay, so this is the, the horse feeding kit. It comes with one carrot and one apple and a big old thing of hay. It's really nice. It's nice and secure with some plastic. And I think that is really cute. They did a great job with that. They just knew what to put in, because horses love carrots, apples. This is, Vel this is Velcro here. So you open it up. And this first place, of course, everyone's horse is first place. It just simply attaches, there's some Velcro right here, which is how you're able to set this stable up, just like the dog houses. I wonder if they still sell dog houses because I have an like I have like um over a ten year old dog house that you put it together through Velcro, just like this. So, anyway, so you can put it either on this side or this side. It's up to you. Way up here, as long as there's Velcro. We don't here, just anywhere you like. So let's take let's take her out. Come on, Dom Rider. Right. 
So at the bottom here, we got the horseshoe, shaped like a heart, looks like a horseshoe. Remember, there's four sounds. We're back to that one again. All right. And I decided to buy some flowers. That's an option. They actually have two different kinds of flowers you can put in this horse's mane. And I like these flowers really well, so I bought those. And the saddle. I like this color the best. They had pink and red and dark blue, but I liked this one the best for this uh, for the Palomino color. And before I get on with any more of the horses, let's take a look on the inside of the stable. You can undo the saddle and the bridle and all the, the you know, the blanket. And it just simply, you can just take, just put it right there. You drape it. There's one on this side and one on this side. It's just the same. And they also sell a blanket that horses wear like if it's cold out. That's also separate. So I guess you could put the uh, equipment on this, the riding equipment on this side and the blanket on this side. However you like. Alright. Got a gold rhinestone there. Let's go over to this guy. Thoroughbred. Mr. Ed. You see the gold rhinestone here is up here. Now this one's a little different. Considering there's a comparison here. The um, mine. See the difference. Here we go. This one has has extra is extra long for some reason. Versus this one, it's not. It's just like a st regular. Thing you grab onto. And another thing that's different uh, is that they have this extra part that comes in the back right here. Now I don't know about the red one and the pink one, but I can just tell, show you, tell you the difference between these two. Mine, all mine has is just this thing that comes up like here, here, and of course the, you know, the bridle and the bit. And I took the saddle off here, so this is what the blanket, um, uh, a saddle cover, I think they call it. I'm not sure. It's not a blanket cover. A blanket is what is wrapped around the horse for the cold night. This is the pattern here. So you just simply open that up and just drape it inside there. Now this one, a Mr. Ed, is just plain. But still a very nice, very nice color. You got dark color with dark color. And I love how their manes are just on the opposite side. Alright, let's take it. There, look at this guy. They're just so cute. I've been waiting for Build a Bear to do horses. I'm glad they did. And of course, nothing on this guy because he's a boy. Alright guys, that's everything. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and check out my social networks. Those are a lot of fun. Alright, bye.